break and has been interesting and educative. We are continuing with our interview session. And when I heard this particular group was coming, I bet you I had to take two fingers of banana just so my voice would be pretty. Who knows, maybe I could feature in their next song. I have with me in the studio one of the oldest music groups in Ghana. And they've been able to stand the test of time, even though it hasn't been easy. But I'm so pleased. And right now, they are making waves. Is the, the information about them is so um, interesting. They are coming back together. They had to go away for some time, go solo. But fortunately, they are back again. Prior, welcome to Spotlight. Thank you, thank you, thank you. You're looking <laughs> and good. Thank you very much. <laughs> just like you. Congratulations. I thank see you. your finger is just shining. Yeah, and yeah, It's yeah, been yeah, like yeah. this since you came. Yes. <laughs> Prior Tinte, yeah. welcome. Yeah, thank you so much. So how has it been? Where have you been? Especially Prior Tinte. Me, I've been around. Um, since we split it, uh, mm -hmm. I've been doing my own things. You know, I'm, I'm, I'm always in the studio. I'm a studio boy. Um, so I, I went back to I mean, do what I could do best, that is the beat, before the rap thing. So, I mean, I've been in the studio creating more stuffs, and that is the prior thing. I was a little person. I always like music, <laughs> music. So, Great. not on the scene, just behind the scene to music thing. So, prior thing is full of music. Okay, before yeah. we delve into your, your group issues, can you tell us about Tigo Unplugged? You're performing all <coughs> right? Yeah. Just tell us about it. Yeah, basically, um, I think when they heard about uh, we were actually the, the the last addition to the to the, the team, you wow. know, when they heard about our, our comeback, they were very very pleased. Okay. And you know, Tigo always want to associate themselves with uh, the best. And when they heard our award winning group is back, hey, I mean, they just called on us, and we said, yeah, hey, I mean, Tigo has been doing a lot for the Ghana music these days, so sure. um, why why not? I mean, Tigo Unplug is one of the biggest you know um, outdoor shows in Ghana. What should fans look out for on the 28th of November? I mean, something, something different. People already know what prize, like, yeah. what we are capable of doing. So now going back and coming back together, people should just expect something sick, something <laughs> better, you know. <coughs> you change, uh, the loss is longer now. Yeah. I mean, we, 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 have, uh, we have changes to mm -hmm. Tita is married. I'm also a, fam <laughs> a family man <laughs> now. So I think, you know, um, fans should just expect something Different, yeah. different. It's like homecoming yeah. for us. Um, I mean, most people um, have forgotten that we actually um, uh, um, launched our first album, I'm a Shodi Awan, mm -hmm. in, in Kumasi. So Great. Kumasi is like where we started from. So it it's like homecoming for us. It's sure. been like four years. They've never seen us together. And um, um, this is the first time they're going to see us on stage. And trust me, we are bringing a lot of surprises. <laughs> Things that will make them, you know, you know, cast their mind back but and like, this is my group. This is the group we've been we, okay. we missing okay. for four okay. years. <laughs> I mean, we have, we have Angelina on board. Yes. We have a um, couple of people that, you know, we don't want to uh, <laughs> disclose. Sure, 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 sure. Because, uh, there's you a whole package. Yeah, you should keep it. Yeah, you should keep whole it. Package. It's going to be a big we, one. We, 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 want, we just want to keep, we want, we want keep to remind, uh, remind people of a whole lot because it's been years. We know they've missed us, especially at the time. <laughs> you know, I just can't wait to see the crowd because yeah. I know what to expect from there. They should just come in their numbers. Beautiful. For me, it was very difficult to accept the fact that Prayer was going solo because mm -hmm. we accepted you as a group yeah. and your separation was really very sad. And I'm sure your fans out there as well, not just me, but <laughs> everyone. Yeah. What triggered the re reconciliation? Um, well, I think um, we've been doing this for over a decade now and um, uh, our fans, I mean, they're the ones, I mean, we, we salute when it comes to any, because, it, I mean, prayer is bigger than all three of us. Sure. And um, our solo really broke their heart. Um, our, so our split really broke their heart. And we felt it's about time. I mean, we've been getting calls here and there. We've been getting a lot of messages mm -hmm. from our fans. Mm -hmm. I mean, we're like, okay, I mean, how long can we, can we keep on ignoring our fans? So let's come together. Let's, I mean, this is, this is a, 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 um, um, a company we build ourselves. Why, why throw it away and okay. go solo? So basically, it's, it's in respect of our fans. We're coming back, you know, to, to tell them that, I mean, we are coming, we are, we are together now. We aren't going anywhere. Yeah. Mm -hmm. the, the group is fully united, uh, even okay. though there's one person missing, but yeah. still the reunion is still ongoing. Sure. And very soon, you never know, you might have uh, an addition of, uh, but definitely don't be a subtraction. Maybe. Sure, sure, sure. You never know. 